It's so nice when the offense is showing up today. You'll love to see it. Can Cody B make me cream again? Speaking of cream, I'm thinking about buying the new Milwaukee Bucks jerseys that have Cream City. Cream City in my pants! Another one gone. Inappropriate as sh**. Oh my goodness. You just love that pitch down the middle, don't you? Cody B with the rain. What the f*** was that? What? Whoa. Holy sh**. Hey, how's it going, everybody? For today's video, we're going to be doing a 99 Signature Series Miguel Cabrera debut. Now, comparing him to my current third baseman, which is the 99 finest Alex Bregman, you can see that Alex Bregman clearly has way better stats in both the hitting and fielding department. The one thing that could truly make a difference between these two cards, not only just the stats, is if Miguel Cabrera has a good swing, but if the pass is any type of precursor, Miguel Cabrera doesn't usually have that great of a swing, so we'll have to see. So again, just looking at his overall stats, he's got 121 contact on right, 123 contact on left, 103 pop, with 101 pop on left, 102 vision. His PCI is going to be relatively big, not as big as, say, Rogers Hornsby, but it'll be up there with 75 fielding and 82 arm strength. I ain't going to lie. This year, they've been pretty gracious with some people's defense, Glaber, and now we got Miggy. I don't... 75 fielding is pretty nice. So again, he'll be our third baseman. In left, we'll have Babe Ruth, Ken Griffey in center, Cody B in right. Lou Gehrig will be at first for Mr. Hornsby over at second. Honus Swagner at short. Of course, at third, again, we got Miguel Cabrera. And behind the dish, we still got Ron Jeremy, which I need to real quickly find a new swing for him because my Odyssey was delivering terrible exit velocities. All right, so we did fix this swing. He'll be rocking with the 2008 Chipper Jones swing. The way the lineup's gonna go, we got Griffey in center, Honus Wagner in the two spot, Lou Gehrig hitting third, Miguel Cabrera hitting fourth, trying to get him as many clutch at bats as possible. Runners on, Babe Ruth in the five spot, Hornsby, Cody B, and Ron back in the eighth spot. So we are currently rated at 10 24. Let's go ahead and get right on into this. Our opponent for today is going to be the Icon 148 from New York. He's going to have Nolan Ryan on the mound. We're going to have DeGrom, so we get it also debut DeGrom as well. He's got Tony Gwynn, Alomar, Ken Griffey, Teddy, ball game with Ernie Banks. He's got himself a good team. And he's using Mike. Again, this is the first time that I've been able to use DeGrom. And what better way to start off using the new pitcher than grooving it right down the middle at a boy. Now, I don't know if his two seems dirty, but that's usually the pitch I tend to float a lot. And that actually ended up in a good spot. Just a good hit up the middle. Man off first with speed. First pitch stealing. Gonna have to be careful of that from my opponent. We're gonna go to Old Faithful. Fastball up and away. 0-2 the count. We're gonna see if he wants to slide cheese to the nuts or down the middle. Blow bomb here. And that is true. DeGrom slider is at 92. A slider with pure gas. And we're gonna go ahead and get something thing that I love to see when my opponents do it line out to center we get ourselves out of the jam let's go ahead let's get the unicorn and score in the first Griffey oh we got a hanging change up on the 2-0 found a way to get on top of it out number one Honus is gonna drive it and that one is definitely gonna get down outfield playing back but we are not going to be able to turn that into a double. We got plenty of speed on first. Maybe for once in our lives also, we will steal. 2-0 the count. Lou Gehrig launches one, but is it gone? Or is it because we're in the first inning, we ain't getting sh**? Loud out number two. Well, I got some bad news for you guys. Miguel Cabrera's swing still blows, just like in years past. All right, if we're being honest, not a terrible first inning obviously we didn't score but we were making good contact with everybody other than our debut players so sounds like we're back to normal let's go ahead and throw a curveball and that is getting hammered for a double what's weird is certain pitchers in real life that do really well like Noah Syndergaard and also Jacob DeGrom get absolutely rocked in this game and I don't get why I mean because they technically have a good arsenal they just must not be funky enough full count is he gonna chase the change cheese hey -ya! Gonna throw that changeup just out of the zone, or it's gonna float on us a little bit. Gets the job done either way. Now we're gonna throw the slider just off the plate, but we gotta locate good pitch. Atta boy to Grom here. Let's get the offense going, Babe Ruth. You're on the hot seat. All right, well, uh, Babe Ruth's buns keep getting hotter because he's on the hot seat. Ted Williams might be making a comeback. Hornsby drives it. That thing is smoked, and there is no way. I don't know if he's got Ted and left, but whoever's out there, doesn't doesn't matter who. 
We got ourselves another double. Let's capitalize. Let's get a run. Cody B. Make me cream and make your girl scream. I did it backwards because he's hitting tanks. Two to zero. Run. I think I just got underneath it, and that would be the case. Deep fly out to right. Out number two. Unfortunately, no mustache rise for the fam, but can Jacob DeGrom, pitchers who rake, pitchers who hit foul balls. Let's go. Oh, DeGram, get it over, get over his head, DeGram, DeGram, however you call them, pitchers who rake, let's capitalize Ken Griffey. Not gonna lie, absolutely awful at bat with Griffey, I don't, there's always one at bat a game where I just look absolutely lost with Griffey, and then the next four or five, he does amazing, so... Hopefully that's the only one. He hasn't swung yet on the 0-2 count. We're gonna go and throw a two seam. Oh, right down the middle. Had a boy. And thankfully, Lou Gary, super athletic today. Out number one. Three-one. I said something positive about how good this man locates. Not only do we throw a bunch of balls, we threw a two seam down the meat to Tony, who could easily go deep on anything. Out number two. Oh one. Okay. I shut my mouth. Holy crap, Miguel Cabrera make the play. Yeah, maybe if it was Bregman, maybe. Who knows? This is a pitch that we're going all the marbles. It's going to go great or it's going to go bad. Forcing gas. She's low and in. Freeze him. Lock him up. Yeah. We need insurance. And who knows? Maybe the next uniforms will be State Farm Insurance logos because Hone is out here delivering packages and packages of straight State Farm Insurance. Let's go. Lead off double. Lou Gehrig, what a beast. Change up, low and away. Drives it right over the third baseman's head. Another double back to back. This is our inning. And get on the bag, you psychopath. Miggy! Mm. Had to have just missed it. Intentionally walk, babe. Love it. That is, I was about to say productive out, but that is a productive tank. Three run shot, the Hornadator coming alive. It's so nice when the offense is showing up today. You'll love to see it. Can Cody B make me cream again? Speaking of cream, I'm thinking about buying the new Milwaukee Bucks jerseys that have Cream City. Cream City in my pants. Another one gone. Inappropriate as sh. All right, Ron. You, you need to follow up Cream City with an absolute mustache ride. Just fab. Oh, Ron follows up Cream City with an absolute bomb. This is the offense that you love to see, 8-0. to zero. DeGrom wants in on the party again. Lou Gehrig making another athletic play over at first out, number two. Griffey's going to drive it through this shift. Dog's going nuts. That's always great. Oh, no. That was a great pitch to hit. I missed it, but we are capitalizing. We scored six that inning. Can't hit them all. Eight to zero the score. Throw that curveball. All right, DeGrom out here. Every now and then, he's, he's kind of hanging stuff. But for the most part, now he's locating really well. Out number one. 2-0. Oh, let's kind of float this change up a little bit. I said a little bit. It doesn't have to be a perfect pitch. Ends up being a perfect pitch. And Miguel Cabrera with the range. Out number two. Oh, two. And speaking about great mustaches, we will be doing a great mustache team build. That way we can only be delivering mustache rides all the time. Two, two, we're gonna try and get him again with the gas cheese. Down the middle, Lou Gehrig Athletic is all held today on both sides. He made a great play for my opponent. He's made two for me. Speaking of two, we need two more runs and we got the mercy. All right, Miguel Cabrera, we are power swinging. We're gonna do something good. We're gonna do something really bad, all right? Definitely not a fan of Miggy. We got jammed up a little bit on that one from Babe Ruth. And that is definitely not going to bleed in. But let me know what you guys think of Miguel Cabrera. Because I think he's flaming hot garbage. Two seam it away. That's my boy DeGrom. One pitch. One amazing pitch. One out. You know what? Let's go ahead and do Old Faithful yet again. Fastball gas. Up and away. Two pitches. Two outs. DeGrom. You are surprising me. 1-0, we uh, finally missed a pitch. And speaking of missing, there's one. Our opponent is not having the best of luck. I'm not going to lie. He's, a, he's, a, he's lined out at least once an inning. But you know what? It's sometimes nice to receive that karma right on back. We still need to. Can we get it done? And that is murdered into center. That is going to be 
exactly what happened for the last out of last inning come on we need three tanks from you cody b three for three three tanks you may not have a mustache but you could receive honorary mustache ride of the day oh my god he just he just f ron oh yeah chipper swing on ron money back-to-back -back solo shots to give us the mercy we're gonna go ahead and get on into another one real quickly before we get into that next game though cody bellinger three for three three tanks ron the mustache man two for three two tanks hornsby two for three a home run a double hone two for three with a double the offense showed up can it please show up next game too our second opponent for today is going to be jake makes you laugh i remember playing him earlier this game if i'm not mistaken should be played on legend difficulty christian yeah Honus Wagner, Alomar Chipper. Got himself a good team. Mixed in with JT Realmuto. One, two, change up just out of the zone. Oh, uh, he anoints it now. Surprise him. Three, two, curve cheese. Dude, that curveball is a saving grace of Zach Greinke. We got ourselves out number two. Two, one, we need to get back to. We need to throw first pitch strikes challenge and stop throwing it down the middle challenge. Dude might be needing to come around, but we get blessed with another line out for out number three. Let's go ahead we need the unicorn griffy unicorn griffy base it up the middle our opponent took off the shift too because i mean i know for a fact we played each other multiple times i'm sure he knows i always look to beat the shift honus please get by the shortstop ah sh the thing was smoked and pancaked but no cigar see what i did there i'm proud of myself oh this inning started off real nice base hit line out and that was buns that was actually a really good first inning just like last game good first inning but no real cigar we're gonna go ahead and pit, throw one pitch one out i always want to make sure that i score first but and uh throwing changeups down the middle ain't gonna be the way you do that chief you got a man out first you still keep the double play in order full count not even close here we go that's bad totally bad totally great execution grinky oh two maybe maybe oh oh cody b get on your horse that was supposed to be out of the zone cody b with the range with the lock in and that last millisecond sprint i don't know if he was gonna catch that without that who knows oh two oh and we get absolutely blessed with a seeing eye ground ball let's let's turn this into something good hornsby Come on, another late hit. Give me something stupid. Let's get... Don't get hosed that second. All right, I was about to say, I want luck. I want good sh Full count. I could be stupid and steal. Not doing it. Oh. Looks like I should have done it. Sub for double plays, and I can never, even when I the game finally goes like, we're going to throw you a bone. You look like ass. I can't ever execute, and I don't blame him for walking me. I blew it. Grinky the other way anybody else that's a guaranteed tank but the wrong person to ever really square it up with i couldn't do that with cody bellinger i i hate myself i need to find a way to not be the best choke artist on this game i find a way to get base hits to start off almost every inning and it is still a rarity that i score it's it's more often than not that i give up home runs to pitchers than not oh two that's yeah all right, two batters, two completely failed pitches. And again, every time I choke, what happens next inning? I get murdered. We're going to have a quick hook on Grinky. I mean, all game he's been relatively... He may not have been squaring him up all game, but you can definitely tell that he's reading the pitches pretty well. So like I said, quick hook. Got ourselves out number one. Oh, yeah, throw that changeup down the middle. Oh, what kind of camera view is this? We get out number two. I don't know what the hell that was. If we find a way to get out of this with only two runs allowed, that is, considering that we give up two solo shots in a row, that wouldn't be that bad. But Cody Ballinger, get on your horse. Quit jogging. Griffey, that was a hanging changeup. Tell me we got all of it. That is an absolute moonshot. She is gone. We get one run back. Lou Gehrig, oh, I was going to say base it up the middle, but hit it a little too hard right to the center fielder. Out number two. Congratulations, Cabrera. I think I found the car that I hate the most this year. 2-0 changeup down the middle. Dude, Grinky, you are looking great. 
we got blessed we're gonna go ahead and take it so we're gonna go fastball away great pitch great hit that is not one that just good pitch great hit kind of don't want to face wainwright considering every time that i face a pitcher that can actually hit it goes bad and shocker ball four two seam don't know what you're looking for but here the legend of babe ruth is tainted hornsby got a pitch to drive he's driving it but please tell me we are getting railed this inning cody b drives it N not too much we can do that inning one two should be a good change hey that actually hung on us a little bit compared to where i wanted it but babe ruth buddy i know you're stupid thick but let's just unhook the trailer 2-1 come on i need him to chase so far we haven't got him to chase Yo, Grinky, you're playing with straight fire. 0-1 oh, should be a good curve. Hey, you sat back on that a little bit, but it looks like you sat back a little too much. We get ourselves a line out to center. We need one. Last inning, we did put good wood on the ball. Let's do that again, and hopefully that translates to some runs. Ron's going to drive it. No, please get over his head. Tony is going to hit it. I think came off the bat really odd so we were probably underneath it out number two griffey smokes it on the ground it is gonna eat up alomar but not enough all right maybe eventually we'll break through but you know what i'll take some of that back got ourselves out number one four cement that is down the middle but honus wagner dirty plays over at short out number two two oh very familiar spot and you know what at least right now me and my opponent are sharing the good luck Honus the other way. Who's got the bowl of electric eels? I'm looking to absolutely dunk my nuts in him right now. Yeah, on a full count. Don't know what I'm looking for. Cutter's down the middle, though. Might want to add that to the list. Miguel Cabrera got a hit. Yo, we're scoring 10. Sinker. Oh, that's bad. That is great. Yeah. We're going to need you to go to distance, Romo. Way to make him roll over. But can Honus make the play 82 speed? The gun out number two. I don't blame him for not taking out Wayno. I mean, he's 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 just inducing balls to go to everybody. We got ourselves a one, two, three inning. Please tell me this is where we break it through. This is the middle of our lineup. All right, I got to figure out. All right, this last inning. Has not done well for me at all. We went from squaring up everything and no luck to we don't deserve anything. Cody. I need the blender stat. I'm going to go ahead and cut that one inside. Jam him. Let's not give him something stupid, Honus. Get on your horse. Out number one. Let's go sinker inside. Good pitch. Blow by. Cutter just off the plate or down the middle. And we get him to roll it over. Miguel Cabrera, stay the hell away from anything. If you come up in a clutch situation, I'm pretty sure he's getting, he's going to be gone. That's bad. That is so bad. For how bad that pitch is, for it to only be a single, I'm not complaining. Sinker down the middle. Oh, boy. That should more than likely lead to a run. If we get a good animation off the wall, he's not going to be able to go home. And he... That could be huge. If we get out of this, that is really huge. Oh, that's so bad. Oh, that's so good. End up paying off. That was a deep fly out. The luck this game, I, I'm, again, on both sides, has been absolutely atrocious. But can we get one run? Just a sitting. And the next inning, we'll do good things. Wayno giving up one run is bullshit. Good times. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Out number one. Let's get ourselves a one, two, three inning. Kenley, buddy. I don't even know how that is still in the same universe. Out number two. Oh, my goodness. You just love that pitch down the middle, don't you? Cody B with the rain. What the f was that? What? Whoa. Holy sh I got, I, I, I honestly got to see this. Is there a springboard in this man's glove? What the hell is this? Even if he didn't somehow hit it with his glove, how the hell does that happen? 3-1, we're going to have to groove a pitch because I am not 
going to face Christian Yelich. And you know what? Wayno almost does it to me again. I had to do it. But we're still bottom of the ninth. Down by two. Two runs should never be an issue. Can we do it? Miggy, oh, tell me that's going to be clutching the gap. Miggy has got ice in the veins. Babe Ruth, come on. Get by the left fielder. Oh. I mean, it was a close, good game. Fortunately, that was a game that you just... You, you couldn't find a way around anything. I was just, I'm convinced there was nothing that I could do. Ken Griffey, two for four. Cabrera actually showed up. The one game, it truly didn't matter that he showed up. Two for four, a double. Hornsby, one for three. Ron Jeremy, 0 oh for two, making the notable players out of boy. Like I said, nothing you can do with that game. I have no idea on both sides what anyone could have done truly that much better. But thank you guys for watching today's video. If you enjoyed today's content, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Y'all have a good day. Thank you.